friends. Um, got an update now on the trip to. Uh, I'm gonna recall. I'm gonna rephrase it. It's called Escape from Ontario. So this is an update video on Escape from Ontario. Uh, I'm in day four of quarantine in uh, beautiful Campton, Brunswick. Uh, the little intro video there, the shot was a box Dixie chicken. Uh, my real estate agent, Eileen Fairburn, lovely lady, beautiful. She brought me supper. Uh, she's been concerned about me being trapped um, in isolation. And, 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 and you know, friends, like it's really great that you have somebody that, uh, you know, it, it's definitely East Coast hospitality because she is quite concerned and she said you know what Jim I'm gonna bring you some beautiful chicken and she did and it was good chicken a little bit reminiscent of uh, K-Fry but a little less heavy on the coating which I kind of liked it I liked it that way I ample helping of fries and uh, yeah I can't wait to bring the whole family there or get some when they get out here uh, Spending all my time doing training for the new job, SOP stuff like that. Um, so you know, we'll see how that goes. Uh, missing everybody, of course. It's been a, it's been a bit of a arduous journey. Uh, not sleeping all that well. Getting woke, waking up in the middle of the night. Today wasn't too bad. I slept in the quarter to quarter to six. Every other night, day I've been up in the middle of the night. So, you know, yeah. Getting to like instant coffee again, like the old days. Uh, some of my friends out there will know that uh, instant coffee was quite the thing. Let me turn around here. Look at that background back there. Isn't that great? Yeah, instant coffee was a thing back in the day. For us old timers. Nescafe. <laughs> so I'm going to spin the camera around and give you guys a shot of this bay. Now it is influenced by the tide, of course, because it's on the ocean. But today it's got good view. You can see, you really see, I don't know how well it's going to turn out, but we'll give it a shot. And so there you go. Uh, hopefully that'll turn out pretty good. I get some good, uh, good view off of, uh, There's the bridge. That bridge goes into Quebec. So that gives you an idea uh, just how wonderful the sights are. Again, lots lots to see here. I uh, this is it. This is as far as I get to go is the balcony. So it's not it's not ideal, but it is what it is. Uh, Trying to work out how I'm going to get some stuff moved up, looking at different U-Haul packages or different uh, uh, somebody, you know, U-Haul or um, Enterprise. So I'm trying to figure out, you know, I'm going to get a lot of stuff up here. Got some stuff to do. Got to get a real estate agent in the house and see what that's going to be looking like. Get that ready. Family's going to have to do some hard work without me. Um, cause I'm on this end going to be doing some hard work. Uh, the house purchase is at the lawyers. Uh, as a matter of fact, I don't know if you can see it, but that's the law. I can't even see into this. That's the lawyer there up the road. That's, uh, Delaney and Duguay. So that's who the lawyer is going to be. Uh, if you ever come to Campbellton or New Brunswick, uh, the first thing you need to do is to go to a parking lot and cut your exhaust off your car so it's really, really loud. Because they're all really, really loud around here. You can hear exhaust constantly. I don't know what these guys do. Chop the exhaust off their vehicles. And when you go downtown, you got to hammer it as hard as you can. Like, don't don't hold back. Just let, her, let the bulldog eat. Because that's what they do. It, that seems to be the the fun here like, I guess that's okay I'll, I'm glad I won't be living downtown too much longer um, it's uh, you know coming from racetrack days it's kind of funny but whatever um, I'd like to really take a walk down to that park that park over there you can see there's a little park at 
or whatever. I don't know. But I, I, that'll be one of the first places that I go to. I'm going to see if I can spy anybody out there fishing or whatnot. Uh, so that kind of gives you an idea of what we're looking at. There's downtown. It's really hard for me to shoot because I can't see into the phone. So I'm a little bit struggling. So if stuff gets off frame, let me know. Well, it doesn't matter anyway. You can let me know what you want. But just leave your complaints in the leave your complaints in the comments down below cuz you, you 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 know, someone will complain. It's okay. I get it. And uh yeah. So that's the update. Day 4. Uh 10 more to go before I can actually move around. And uh that's that's where we're going to be next is uh, I think property manager says it He's going to kick me out of this unit because this unit is for isolation or quarantine, whatever you want to call it. And then I'm going to go to another unit for two weeks and then from there I'll be moving into my house. And that'll be a good video to shoot. Uh, I hope the content level goes way up after that and we're able to do some fun things, some different things. Um, we'll, we'll have to see how it goes. So, anyway... Um, 332 subscribers we haven't had uh we haven't broke anymore i mean i've been trying to promote the channel around different places on facebook uh, for different ideas and i haven't uh i haven't been able to, to promote it any any better so i'm going to post this and uh, uh we'll see what goes on uh, anyway escape from ontario and uh yeah video number two so more to come remember subscribe um hit the like button and uh you know we hope to see you hope to see you on the channel and you guys can enjoy the the content um <clears throat> yeah that's it for now we'll see you soon take care